today we made hot chocolate. I've already drank half of mine. I loved it. Um, it says that you can do a teaspoon to two teaspoons per day. Um, so I put a teaspoon in mine, but I'm going to have more. So I'll probably add another teaspoon in the kids. I put half of a teaspoon. So this is what we did. We put local honey and mushroom powder. And then over here, I mixed up milk, water, and cocoa powder. So the ratio that I do is I fill up, say a cup like this, maybe three fourths with milk and then a little water because I use whole um, milk. I pour it in here. For every mug, I'm gonna do a fourth of a cup. So I used four mugs of liquid. So I used one cup of cocoa powder. So basically, cocoa powder and milk. I do not wanna cook my local honey or my mushroom powder. Now, I don't know, maybe you can cook this and it's fine. You can cook normal mushrooms, I don't know, but I have left it raw just because I assume that it's better. So now I'm gonna mix this in. It, the mushroom powder dissolves really well. Um, I was really surprised by that, but it dissolves really well. The only thing I think that it might do is it might actually um, settle at the bottom over time. So if you're a busy mom and you forget your coffee and then you go back to it, it may, um, may not be there. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna use this little milk frother to kind of make sure that it gets it blended all in really, really good. So anyways, I am super excited about this drink. I feel like it's very, um, I mean, it's still got sugar in it, but I feel like considering we all drink sugar and coffee when we drink coffee, or at least a lot of us do, then probably this is a lot better. So, and my cocoa powder, I don't have it, but I'm sure it's like organic, raw, you know, straight from the bean type thing. So probably good cocoa powder that has good benefits and antioxidants and mushrooms and local honey. I'm so excited.